All right, hey y'all, uh, welcome back to the DK the Goddess Palace. I will be doing the Divine Feminine, um, Divine Feminine read. Okay, let me just let y'all know, right? I'm working with Dalmatian Jasper, Lapis Lazuli, and Tiger's Eye. When I was first coming into this um reading, reading, right? The Tiger's Eye and the Lapis Lazuli, it made me feel like people are not wanting you to speak your truth here. Or maybe there are going to be situations in the next five days where you'll be speaking your truth here. But being honest, Tiger's Eye also talks about grounding, abundance, money coming in. Okay, but I definitely feel like a lot of good things are going to be happening over the next five days as well. We're going to get into different situations with different people here. I definitely feel like people are not wanting you to win. Yes, thank you, Spirit. Um, One of the cards flew home. So, Divine Feminine, I definitely feel like there's going to be a, an upheaval here where people, it's like, um, overall, over the next five days, I definitely feel like there's going to be a need for you guys to look out for people that are trying to um, push your luck or get into your luck. It's going to be your um, ancestral miners or try to uh, perpetrate or, like, um, get into get into what you're trying to do here, okay, Aunt Caroline. Dr. Buzzer, like, I feel like some of you guys have things that you guys are working on, okay? It's like, you guys may also be, um, balancing certain things out when it comes to yourself here, not really paying attention to the past, okay? Them bones, I make, that makes me feel like endings here, or some type of clarity that you're going to get, or like I said, someone could be also going to work on you as well, could be an older woman, older man, or someone that's like, in your in your age group or doing in the same field of work as you okay eight of coins and a railroad bill nine of coins like i said someone's trying to stop i really feel like someone's trying to stop your finances here or put work on your finances here or do work for your finances but i feel like again it's not going to work it's going to backfire the nine and the eight of coins makes me feel like someone has been trying to do this over and over and over again um but i'm also getting you can be working on something over and over and over again over the next five days where you could be seeing like your work your hard work paying off as well i definitely feel like you can also be the the dr blizzard makes me feel like someone that's in a higher position here co-workers bosses as well like someone may not have expected you to get something here co-workers or something like that because the railroad i feel like some of you may have had some type of plan to go against you or to um work against you is what i'm hearing or not really be on your side but for a lot of you guys i feel like your work is paying off here okay i definitely feel like this can also be if you're into the spiritual occult if you did any type of candle magic spell magic okay moon magic water magic fire magic as well or speaking out against somebody you're going to be seeing that backfire i'm also getting um you could be trying to do work on a healer or a spiritual reader such as myself because the high priestess card came out so this can be someone with um some type of spiritual abilities very sensitive okay can read like me is what i'm saying so i'm also gonna have to take you to this reading as well so i'm also gonna go back into this reading because i feel like a lot of these messages are pertaining to me um as well as the collective okay so Again, whatever you guys are working on, I definitely feel like it's going to pay off. You're going to be seeing a lot of money. I feel like in the past or maybe you've gone through certain situations when it comes to people not really um, taking their time, not really taking you seriously here or um, maybe not believing in you is what I'm getting. But I feel like now there's going to be a switch where you're not going to be seen as some type of teacher, healer, mentor, advisor, guide, okay? Or whatever you do for work, you're very blessed or you're very good at it with your hands. Okay, I'm also getting them bones. I feel like someone may have also been paying a practitioner to work against you here. Um, or yeah, like I said, someone may have been getting readings about you. This can also be readings about me trying to get work done on me or something like that, or work done on you. But them bones is like something is not gonna happen. And there is like something's gonna backfire. They're gonna realize maybe this is the reason why people have been dying and their families being sick, or this is the re this is like some type of result that you're gonna be seeing. Okay. Um, cause you see how, like, the look on her face, okay, it's like whatever she was doing, whatever she was working against, whoever she was working with is backfiring here as well. I'm also going to, someone may also have been trying to do work on you here, but they realized that whatever they were trying to do to you, um, like, you're not, you're not who they say they were is what I'm getting. Like, may, I'm definitely getting, someone may have also been lying on you, um, as well is what I'm getting, Divine Feminist. And the truth is also going to be spoken, okay? So I definitely feel like um, 
there's a need for you guys to look strength bars, look, move forward, have courage, keep doing what you're doing. Um, especially because this graphic was really the tiger that I came out. That made me feel like I'm in the right place, I'm in the right time. Okay, my angels are around you, around me, my ancestors, okay? I'm being protected. It's also like some of may also have been trying to shut me up or they want me to say these messages here. I definitely feel like someone could definitely be like 26, 26, 32, 41, 40, um, 50, okay? It, it, this can also be people that are on spiritual, like, like on their spiritual journey themselves. This can also be other readers is also what I'm picking up that may have been doing this. Or like I said, someone may have been just starting their journey. Someone can also be jealous of what you do as well. Divine Feminine, like if you're a hairdresser or a nail tech or something like that, this may be someone that's like, um jealous of you is what I'm getting, like trying to stop your finances, okay, but I'm also getting be aware of who you speak to, because the be aware came out, okay, the luck came out, and the thorns came out, and I don't know why I went here first, because normally I go through the messages, but I'm just going with spirit, so I feel like a lot of you guys in the next five days, there needs for you to be aware of the people that is coming to you, maybe giving you money here, or giving you false praise, false accolades, well, thorns, okay, I definitely feel like someone can also be trying to like, um, it's like someone can't be trusted. It's like someone can't be trusted. People can't be trusted here. I feel like if someone's trying to buy your products, your services, or try to come towards you here, it's need for you to look at what you're doing or who you're servicing. Okay? I definitely feel like someone may also be trying to invest in you, but to try and stop your money. Or someone could be trying to give you challenges when it comes to your money, when it comes to your finances, but it's not going to work. I feel like you're doing something in a whim, like in a whim, like you're being spiritually led. Like, for instance, for some of you guys, maybe, um... Today, this can be today, tomorrow, whenever you see this, okay? Because I'm doing this on Sunday, 8-8, eight, eight, Lionsgate. So I feel like this is like karmic energy where um, karma is now being placed upon these people that may have been shady, shifty, trying to take from you as well, okay? Especially if you were a giver, if you were giving advice, or you were doing things out of the goodness of your heart. I definitely feel like a lot of luck is coming back to you here, and I feel like people are going to be weathering challenges, that may have been trying to stop your flow, stop you from doing what you were supposed to do here, or jealous of your light, jealous of your aura, jealous of your energy as well, okay? I'm also getting you, you have a lot of luck on your side here, a lot of, that's Jupiter, Sagittarius energy here. I'm also getting um, Sagittarius, okay? I'm getting Libra, Gemini, I'm getting Leo, again, this is the Lionsgate 11 and 8-8, eight, eight. that's also um, significant, so I feel like there's a lot of things that are happening on Sunday, 8-8-21, eight, eight, maybe you're doing things, you're pushing forward, you're having the strength to do something different as well, so what I'm getting, you're listening to your intuition, but I'm also getting, um, there's like a pace, like you're pacing yourself here as well, I definitely feel like if this was any co-workers or bosses that were trying to work against you when it comes to some type of promotion or something of that nature, I feel like some, something's gonna fall here, and I feel like you are gonna get some type of promotion or some type of job is what I'm getting um over the next five days so you are going to be patient some of you guys are also patient waiting for a response from your employer from a job as well if you're going to get it you are going to get a job if you're waiting for a promotion you are going to get it as well I feel like there's also jealous co-workers or people around you that are not wanting to see you ascend or seeing you um move up in the ladder here as well it's like people around you here maybe someone has been trying to put challenges on you or give you challenges or it's like give you a hard time is what i'm getting when it comes to your job your creative endeavor like i said people like haters okay naysayers like not wanting to sew into your craft or whatever the case may be but like i said be careful who you trust because i feel like some of you guys may be trusting someone when it comes to your money or trusting someone when it comes to something and then you're gonna realize like you were right all along is what I'm getting. I'm also going to, you guys may have been having a feeling about your coworkers or your bosses or um, the people that you work around, okay? This can also be your creative ideas as well, your actions, okay? It's like not to trust people, not to give people your ideas as well, okay? I definitely feel like you are going to be on a luck streak as well. A lot of money is going to be coming to you. I'm getting spiritual payback as well, Okay. But I definitely feel like 8, 8, 11, like Leo energy, this lion's gate, okay, we're in Leo season. So I definitely feel like your intuition is definitely going to be um, heightened. I definitely feel that my energy and just everything in general has been heightened since today. 
okay this is also like a portal so this is also being mindful of um what you're feeding yourself what you're listening to what you're watching as well but the strength card i definitely feel like you guys are moving forward and here's are gonna be it's gonna be a lot of happy times it's gonna be a lot of growth okay it's like you're also standing up for yourself you're doing what you need to do okay like i said someone's definitely like not wanting you to keep talking or not wanting to keep going as well i'm also gonna this was like a strategy to, to like put you in a wrong place in the next five days i definitely feel like you're going to do something um totally different Okay, maybe this is like also have to do with timing, divine timing as well. I feel like you're going to be doing, it's like you're going to be doing your work here and divine timing is going to be at play where someone is going to think that you're going to do one thing, but instead you're going to do something else. Okay, and I feel like this is definitely going to put you in the right place at the right time. Okay, I definitely feel like you are doing things the way that you're supposed to. You're being spiritually led and these challenges, okay, that you're supposed to be looking out for in the next five days. It's like people, okay? People that are like saying, saying A, B, and C. Like, okay, I'm getting, getting a situation where like someone could be like, okay, can you be here on this time, on this day, right? Or can you do this for me? Or it's like um, you're thinking that you're, you're not doing something in the right way, but you are. I feel like some of you guys are going to switch up your strategy, switch up your plan, switch up how you're doing something as well, okay? And I definitely felt that, and I feel like a lot of money is definitely going to be coming in from you, okay? I definitely feel like people are also, like your naysayers, haters, are also going to be watching you as well, okay? I feel like people that may have not believed in you, like I said in the past, they're now looking at you like, wow, you're doing this, you're doing that, or it's like whatever they were throwing at you, it's like the opposite is happening over the next five days. It's like you're getting more momentum here. I definitely feel like you're not really into the drama. This can be um, gossiping at work or just gossiping about other people as well. You're not really paying attention to that. I'm also going to have people are trying to bring you in situations with their own challenges. You're really focused on your money, on your bread here, on your stability. Okay, building yourself up here. You don't have time for that. I'm also going to some of you guys can also be getting some type of um, unveil with a city meetings as well for the people around you. Okay, um, but I definitely feel like a lot of optimistic opportunities. Maybe some of you guys didn't think that you were going to get something here is what I'm getting because of this energy, because of these people, okay, that you were talking to. Or maybe it's like someone was like acting like they were like rooting for you, congratulating you, but in actuality they didn't want you to win, okay. And this could be definitely a Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius, Aries, uh, Libra, Leo, Virgo as well, and I feel like you're going to be seeing all well, the money here, or you're going to be seeing with this upgrade is what I'm getting, okay? So, a time for healing. You're very close to achieving your goal. You are good enough. Believe in the impossible. Your hard work is paying off. What did I just tell you? Prosperity lies ahead. That's why I said money's coming. Show the world the real you. You and your loved ones are safe. Nothing will come out of the situation. A personal, a personal issue reaches resolution. Your commitment is being tested. Meditate and contemplate. Don't let your past fears hold you back. Nothing is yet set in stone. Emotions are running high. Step out of your comfort comfort zone. Okay, so again, um, I definitely feel like a lot of you guys, divine feminine, over the next five days, you guys are going to be stepping out of your comfort zone. A lot of you guys, your emotions are running high because maybe you're really wanting a job right now. You're wanting a promotion. You're thinking of different ideas or ways that you could be more stable or stabil um, stable within yourself. Maybe you guys are also worried or anxious about what you're going to get if you want to get a job, if you're going to get this promotion or something like that. Nothing is just set in stone. I definitely feel like your past, you're going, you're going past your fears. Like, if you were scared to do something, you're not scared to do it. Like, you just like, okay, let me just do this now. Let me just, um, it's like off of, the, off of the whim. Like, you're just doing things, okay? I definitely feel like you're meditating and contemplating on your next steps, okay? Your commitment is definitely going to be, be testing you. Like, your faith in yourself, your faith in how you feel within yourself. Like, you feel like you deserve this. You feel like this is, yes, this is yours. You deserve everything that's coming to you. Okay, it's like everything is starting to switch in your favor here. 
there's nothing will come out of the situation. I feel like this is also telling you like to stop believing, stop believing people, stop believing in people or giving people the benefit of the doubt. They already burnt you. If you already feel some type of way, if you already feel like they're not going to give you what you deserve, if they've been playing around with your money, your business, your services, your products, you get what I'm saying? It's like don't let them burn you twice here. But this is also you realizing that the people that may have burnt you, they're gonna be realizing like they burnt the wrong person. They've been talking around the wrong people. They've been hanging around the wrong people. This that and third. It's like someone tried to predict you, thinking that it was gonna make you better or burn you the bridges, but it doesn't. It makes you greater. It makes you more powerful. It has, it has um giving you more type of strength. That's with that strength card. It's like especially with this portal. It's like something that's powerful is happening. You guys not be going through a spiritual transformation or transition or ascension during this time okay especially for a fire sign aries sagittarius leo okay but i definitely feel like like i said it can be a leo aries scorpio cancer pisces libra aquarius okay virgo gemini that's also working against you okay if you have these um if you have any of these people in your energy like i said 27 up 27 29 30 33 40 44 um 50 in their 60s as well okay it's like older people that are in your field of work or older people that may have been in your like your friends, your past love, your family even, okay? I definitely feel like your loved ones are also safe here. You're like showing a new new you is what I'm getting. A lot of money is coming towards you. It's like your hard work is paying off. A lot of you guys were worried. Like I said, it's like you know how when you apply for a job or you apply or you feel like, okay, I worked and I did all this time, I did all this work, okay, when am I gonna get my um my abundance my return what am i going to get you know what i'm saying and i feel like that's that's patience okay it's leaving you guys to also not think negative as well as the next five days and realize that all your answers all your clarity is coming towards you okay so i definitely got four of ariel four for four that talks about stability right leap of faith okay starting over reset okay king of gabriel you on your shit you doing exactly what you're supposed to do Okay, the nine of Raphael, all your wishes coming true, heart chakra, page of Raphael, new experiences, new emotional upheavals, okay, and then the high priestess, two, 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 so there's a lot of, like, major arcanas in here, all right, zero, that makes me feel like there's a reset, there's a new thing that's coming towards you, a new idea, new opportunities, new people, new clients, okay, I'm also getting your stability, it's like you have nothing to worry about, a lot of you guys are worried about your homes, your, um, your, your jobs here, okay, but it's like you're well protected, you're highly favored, and that's something that, you know, I'm saying, I'm highly protected, I'm highly favored, everything is going in my favor, right, we did the work, we did what we were supposed to do, we put in our time, we put in our energy, we changed, okay it's like we, we start we're taking a leap of faith on what we feel like is best okay we're being spiritually led we know what the fuck we're talking about whatever you do for work cooking okay beauty okay um home and decor home um like reinventing homes stocks okay it's also what i'm getting clothes fashion designers okay it's like your wishes are coming true things are happening faster than you know it. your angels are right behind you the high priestess like i said i'm just telling you like it is but this is also you getting some type of um nudges from the universe this is also you getting dreams this is also you getting divine downloads on your next steps are you balancing out your divine feminine divine master within yourself okay but this is also you going full-fledged and realizing that your hard work King of, Gabriel, King of Gabriel, a lot of you guys may have put in a lot of time in, in the last four to six months, weeks here on a job, and you're realizing, like, hey, this is not working out. This is working out in my favor. This is not going to put me in a more stable place, okay? A lot of you guys may also been may have been looking for homes or wanting to move, okay? Wanting to do things differently, the leap of faith. It's like now you're having a leap of faith to move, okay? It's like things are going to be setting. It's like setting you up is what I'm hearing, okay? Setting you up is what I'm hearing. Setting you up for greatness, setting you up for stability, for security as well. Like I said, you guys don't have nothing to worry about. A lot of you guys were very anxious or waiting for some type of response when it comes to a deal, okay? Maybe a deal, deal, a contract, okay? When it comes to a home, when it comes to a job, when it comes to a promotion here. But I feel like everything is happening the way that it needs to, okay? A lot of you guys can also be living somewhere where the numbers are four, nine, zero, two, three, five, okay? 
You guys can also be living in some type of gated community here as well, where this can be like in a, a complex, okay? Something near water or something near nature is what I'm getting, something near beach, okay? But I'm also going to get being angelic, be guided. Your heart is also being open here. A lot of you guys are going to be very patient with things that are coming towards you. It's like you're waiting for certain um, nudges is also what I'm getting. Just me being a uh, healer, a high priestess, me knowing and seeing the unseen, hearing the unheard, okay? I'm also getting, this is also like your intuition, like my, my intuition is already telling me like, okay, I'm in the right place at the right time. I'm doing things the way that I need to right? It's like not really worrying about what other people think or how other people think about certain situations but going forth in my dreams, right? Believing in yourself, listening to your heart, doing things the way that you know that you need to in order for you to be um, proud or you to be um, happy with yourself, right? But I'm also getting the King of Gabriel, someone that's like, they're not budging. Like, I know exactly what I know. Like, I know my intuition is on point. It's on fire. You get what I'm saying? Like, I know that I'm able to heal and I'm able to help when it comes to my words. But this is also realizing that all the work, that all the situations, cycles, tribulations that we had to go through to burn us alive, like our old self, right? Old beliefs, old um, preconditioned beliefs, old behaviors, old emotions. It led us to being here, to being that boss, that, that, um, that secure, that secure, secure within ourselves. A lot of people you can be seeing here, um, just in general, like you can see a lot of people that are that are actually like maybe they have their own homes already, they have their own A, B, and C already, businesses already here, and these can be people that are jealous, haters, or, or watching you, watching your social platform is also what I'm getting. Okay, trying to siphon your energy where it's like whatever they're trying to do is gonna backfire is what I'm getting. It's like that it's not working. Okay, and I feel like your heart is open. You change you're on a whole other level now and this is why things are going in your favor this is why you're really at peace it's like you're really at peace with how things are going okay that's really what i'm getting i feel like the people that's in your life right now is going to be in your life it's like you don't want nobody new is what i'm getting okay a lot of you guys may also be looking for newness when it comes to a job or um newness when it comes to your creativity friends as well like wanting to switch your friends or your social groups some of you guys may also be wanting to move. Going out in nature. Okay, maybe a lot of you guys are doing some type of spiritual cleanse. Okay, but I feel like... This is like nature, nature, butterflies, transformation, flowers, being at peace, okay? Things coming to you. I definitely feel like there's a, a major push to how how you're acting, how you're being, like you're becoming, right? It's like the high priest is you're becoming a whole new person, a leap of faith. It's like you're starting something totally new, okay? You can also be wanting to move to a totally different state here or wanting to move out move out is what I'm getting, but I'm also getting there's a change that's going to happen when it comes to your stability, your security, your job, yeah, where you're going to be uprooted, upgraded as well, okay, and I definitely feel like your wishes are going to be coming true here, some of you guys may also been wishing for the last nine days, nine weeks, or something like that, when it comes to a promotion or like some type of job factor, I feel like whoever was like against you here when it comes to your job, when it comes to the people um, that support you or um, say yay or nay, I feel like they're going to be coming back around is what I'm getting, but I definitely feel like beware of these people, thank you spirit, beware of these people, beware of these people, okay, so first and foremost, I have the ego, a lot of animals, owl, right, and we keep getting our divine feminine, patience, and cracker like i said over the next five days i definitely feel like a lot of good things are going to be popping off for you i definitely feel like there's going to be a lot of spiritual messages that are coming towards you as well there's a need for you guys to also be patient and realize that everything is happening the way that it needs to like go with your gut okay go with your gut there's definitely a scorpio cancer pisces or some older woman that's going to be um a bitter baby mother or mother figure here that's not wanting to it's like not wanting to give you Give you your props here is what I'm getting. Not wanting to give you your props, okay? The Knight of Swords in reverse, okay? 
I definitely feel like there's going to be a lot of, um, it's like you guys may not be really speaking to somebody here or speaking to people. You're really just emotionally focused on yourself. Ace of Cups, okay? You're really just really passionate about what you need to do and how you need to do it is what I'm getting, all right? All right, so I definitely feel like you guys are gonna be look the lovers is on the bottom of the deck. A lot of you guys just has to do with relationships, connections, environments. Okay, I definitely feel like you're gonna be receiving a lot of downloads when it comes to what you wanna be around, what you don't wanna be around. Okay, what connection that you feel like is beneficial for you here? Because the five of cups makes me feel like there's gonna be some type of situation over the next five days where you feel like you're um. You're needed to cut something off here, Divine Feminine, is what I'm getting. Or it's like you realize that you need to cut something off. Or you need to not really, um, it's like staying, staying by the means of, staying by the means when it comes to relationships, family around you, okay? Judgment is in reverse. The Nine of Pentacles, okay? It's like telling your truth, speaking your truth here when it comes to your abundance or where you feel like you want to go, okay? Maybe this is also like family, like maybe you're tired of your family, or people around you here trying to make you feel like A, B, and C, and you feel like it's best for you to go elsewhere, okay? Judgment is in reverse. This is also someone not being authentically honest with themselves, but this is also someone that's not being fair. So maybe some of you guys are dealing with a situation over the next five days where you're realizing, like, fairness, okay? It's like someone wasn't being fair here. Or maybe someone was trying to make you feel like you aren't good enough or you aren't able to do A, B, and C, but in actuality, you... You exceeded your you you exceeded your own you exceeded your goals here like you did be, you went above and beyond you did more than what you were supposed to okay it's like and maybe this is also has to do with, like I said this is a job situation you guys may have been feeling that remorse because you realize like hey maybe it's better if I if I just don't say nothing okay is what I'm getting. A lot of you guys, you chose to not say anything. You chose to continue to do what you were supposed to do here, regardless of how people were treating you or coming at you is what I'm hearing. And the Nine of Pentacles is like you're getting this reward here. It's like you're getting a reward for realizing that you can cut off bullshit or that you cut off bullshit right at the head of it. It's like you don't have time for it. You're here to make your money. You're here to, to get your, um, your stability and security. You don't have time to be dealing back and forth with people. It's like people may have also been trying to reel you in over the last couple of weeks with bullshit, with like he say, she say, or just talking, okay? And it's like you're not really dealing with it. Others of you, like I said, this is just relationships, connections around you where you know that you need to cut certain things off here. Where you're realizing that things are not balanced and things are not fair. And it's like it's better for you to focus on your own stability, your own money as well. Where it's like you're going to be getting a lot of money, attention, recognition, praise, spiritual payback here. Because like I said, someone around you, this could be an old friend or a group of people as well that may have been lying on you. Is when I'm getting divine feminine. And now that you're stable, successful, like getting what you need. Okay, it's like now people want to be around you or be nice to you as well in a work situation or what have you. I definitely feel like, like I said, you're really focused on... um. Like, like I said, you may have this some type of moon magic. This is a new moon, but like I said, this lion gate is also a portal. So you may have been doing some type of magic here on 8-8, or you may have been doing some type of um, wishing, praying as well, and you're going to be seeing things happen or come towards you quicker than you expect. I definitely feel like um, you have also released yourself from toxic situations or things that no longer serve you here, and you're going to be seeing, like, options that are being available to you here it's like maybe if you thought that you were going to get one job you end up getting three maybe you thought that they were going to be saying something bad about you at some type of job okay but in actuality it turns in your favor and it's like a whole bunch of opportunities or promotions open up or a lot of different things or decisions open up where you have to decide what you want to do when it comes to your work or day in the day at work is what i'm hearing okay i'm also getting you're not really putting a lot of passion in, into people that are sometimey wishy-washy here i feel like you're saving investing ten of cups in reverse you're realizing that you need to change your family dynamic or it's like you're breaking free of generational curses because you're realizing a lot of people in your family is toxic or you realize that a dynamic is toxic here as well or it's like unhealthy okay i feel like you are also getting some type of nudges at night here 
or it's like your spirit is also telling you to keep working, keep pushing through, even if you're even if you're exhausted, okay? I definitely feel like the King of Pentacles in the verse is um you could be dealing with somebody watching you here. A lot of different people that can be watching you as well, watching your social platform, your your videos as well. And I feel like they're trying to throw a lot of um like worries or anxiety project themselves onto you. But I feel like a lot of stuff is not gonna happen the way that it needs to, is what I'm getting. I feel like you're in a very good wholesome relationship connections around you here. You cut off a lot of people in your past, old lovers, old family as well. You can be not speaking to them and you just really focus on your abundance. Okay? The ace of swords, new things are happening to you. Like I said, it's popping off. Okay, crackers, like new things are popping off left and right, left and right, left and right, left and right. Okay, it's like you're also being patient within yourself. If someone was trying to make up some type of plan to put you under the bus, it's gonna backfire. Okay, it's also what I'm getting. I'm also getting like you're making your own moves here. You're thinking, you're thinking with your own um mind here. So maybe someone had a strategy and said, okay, well I want them to um like maybe someone's trying to clock you. This can also be clock you when it comes to time, right? So clock you when it comes to a job, clock you when it comes to your ins and your outs or something like that. Or maybe this is like clocking you as in like watching and watching your every move, trying to figure out your next step, something like that, right? And it's like you're doing something um out the blue. It's like instead of that, instead of you doing this, you like, okay, no, I've changed them, I'm gonna do this instead. And this throws them off, right? And so they have no they have no choice but to respect what you're saying. They have no choice but to say, Okay, yep, you are right. This is what we're gonna do, A, B, and C. You get what I'm saying, moving forward, okay? This can also be, like I said, someone trying to strategically try to mess with your finances, like your job, okay, your um, energy, your time, right, or try to put you in a situation where to make it look like you're not doing what you're supposed to do as a boss of your company, as a employee, as a A, B, and C, right, it's like you're realizing like you taking a time out to figure out what's your best move, right? A lot of you guys are not going to be communicating with a lot of people. You're also going to be seeing people for who they are. A lot of people are also going to show their true colors when it comes to you getting what you deserve here. It's like you walked away from bullshit here. You're on to new paths. You have a lot of ideas in, and you have a lot of ideas that you're going into here, okay? you It's like things that are coming, coming and going fast, right? The Nine of Pentacles, you're going towards greatness, you're going towards success, you're going towards stability here. I'm also getting someone, this can also be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, okay, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, masculine energy here that may have been trying to stop you or may have been trying to throw you under the bus at some type of, um, it's like, or this could be a, a past ex okay this can be a family member as well whatever this is for you it's like you move on you're not really dealing with these people like i said family members as well you're not really talking to a lot of people you're just focused on your stability okay the queen of pentacles is right in the right in the heat of heat of the moment so definitely a lot of you guys are really focused on your stability here you're looking good smelling good you guys may have also been working on your appearance okay change up your got your hair done your nails done your toes done okay saving up money okay investing in yourself okay a lot of you guys may have been um praying more or you guys may have been doing some type of wishing or manifestation or prayers here that you're going to see that's going to make you more successful make you more stable here and it's a it's a lot with timing here as well or doing things at the right time a lot of you guys did something you guys did something at the right time here and it's going to grow your abundance as well your business is also going to grow. You're going to be seeing a lot of clients um, buy your products and services or come towards you. Okay, I'm also getting your blessings are coming faster than you know it here. Okay, you're not really paying attention to the naysayers and the people that are not going to really put their heart into you. Okay, the seven of pentacles in reverse. A lot of you guys are wanting to move out, like I stated before. Six of cups in reverse. And some of you guys may be dealing with something from your childhood. The nine of cups, though, look. It's like things from your childhood may be trying to, like, nag at you day in and day out. Or, ask, like, maybe it's, like, things from the past that you may have thought about yourself. Like, should I do this? Should I not? Am I good? Should I should I listen to so-and-so when it comes to this decision, this action? Or should I just go and follow my heart? The Nine of Cups is, like, you're following your heart and you're getting your wishes fulfilled here. You're actually fulfilled. Some of you guys may have been also waiting for a hear back or, like I said, a response. When it comes to a job here and towards, I'm getting between 
um, the 13th, the 13th, okay, 12th and the 13th, you're going to get a response back about um, you being, like, um, hired, okay, you getting some type of full-time opportunity, you getting some type of promotion here, or it could be a mixture of two or three different things is what I'm getting. Like, a lot of you guys may have a break on a job, and you guys may have maybe added it as, like, more responsibilities here, okay, more pay, more responsibilities, more time and energy, okay, but I'm also getting... It's a need for you guys to also balance when it comes to your business or balance when it comes to what you want to do as well, okay? Because I definitely feel like you guys are going to be in some type of um, commitment, a contract here, right? That your angels, like your angels are guiding you to go towards this way. Your angels are guiding you to go towards a certain, a certain way. Like you're being guided, you're being protected here as well, okay, I do feel like there's a lot of happiness here, a lot of you guys can also be expecting, okay, new mothers as well, but this is also you having the light and energy about you, your energy is definitely being felt, it's a lot of movement, so some of you guys can also be traveling for work or traveling to do something for work here, or someone could be wanting you to travel for work is what I'm hearing, um, you can also be traveling um, a distance for your job as well to get something done, but I do feel like there is going to be some type of happiness, there is going to be some type of um, congratulations for initial praise as well at your job or in the creative field that you're going into or what you do i'm also getting your angels with right on time when it comes to a situation here okay it's like everything happened the way that it needs to it's like some of you guys may also be in relationships connections that are very loving here and it's like a god given okay your ancestors gave you this as a means for you to see what um like between black and white and shadow and your light side for you to help and heal yourself as well. I definitely feel like there's a need for you guys to stay focused. Okay, stay strong, stay focused, open up your heart. A lot of you guys, whatever, um, I'm also getting whatever two, whatever two to three blessings that you get where it's like a, a bunch of blessings, a bunch of abundance, a bunch of peace. Okay, whatever success looks like, looks like to you because a lot of us, success isn't just a lot of money. It's like being able to be free, being able to be mentally at peace, at peace with ourselves. Okay, enlightening, an enlightening journey. So I feel like the sun card is also you realizing that you're on a journey of self or you're going through, you went through your childhood tribulations and this is why you're getting this payback. You, This is why you're getting your rewards, okay? But I'm also getting your ancestors and angels are also around you. If you've been feeling, feeling as if like maybe your skin is crawling or maybe you've been hearing certain things in your ears, like a ringing in your ears, an itching of your nose, okay? Maybe at nighttime you're also talking to yourself or writing a lot, or maybe this is you just being quiet, okay? Getting some type of messages here, or you're not realizing why or how, like, sir, like these videos are not just, like, I'm literally just going with spirit, like, I'm just letting allow spirit and God to work through me, you get what I'm trying to say? And it's like, when you put, like I kept saying before, when you put God first, when you put your spirit, God, and the ancestors first, you realize and you see a lot of things work in your favor, right? And it's like, a lot of us, yes, we have hard times, we have hard lives here, or we may have, we may not even have a lot of friends, you know what I'm trying to say? We may not have a lot of people that really understand us, but that's okay, because our tribe is coming, and that's another thing, maybe you guys have been waiting for new friends or new people to come towards you, because like I said, maybe the old people, the old friends, or they really was just like a, a, a learned lesson or experience that you had to go through, no disrespect, but there's always experiences and lessons that you had to had to go through, you were lessons for other people, and people were lessons for you, right, in order for you to heighten yourself and be in a more, and be in more of an alignment with yourself to get what you need, right? A lot of you guys are also looking for love, and it's like, you're realizing that you have a lot of love around you. Maybe some of you guys are realizing that you're not really alone. I know I'm not alone. My ancestors, God is always around me every single day. So it's like, you're not really alone even when you think that you're alone. You get what I'm saying? And I feel like this movement, this fast moving movement is definitely going to be um, because you're doing exactly what you're supposed to do. You're in the right place at the right time. You're feeling good, right? Some of you guys may also, over the next five days, be waking up in a new sense of energy, a new sense of self, or it's like your confidence. Some of you guys, is like, you need to, some of you guys are either need to work on your confidence, or your confidence is going to be taking a whole tailspin. It's like, you confident in the mug, okay? Like, I'm pretty as hell, I'm smart as hell, I'm the shit, that's it, period. Like, I don't know, like, something different, you get what I'm saying? 
So, I definitely feel like a lot of you guys can be in that type of energy as well. A lot of you guys are also waiting to hear back from certain things. Like I said, some of you guys may also be wanting to put your children in school or waiting to hear back from a school as well or um, what type of schools that you're wanting to put your children in. Those can also be conversations. Those can also be daycare as well. Um, but I'm also going to be family conversations where you're, like, standing up on your own two feet, letting it be known, like, look, this is what I want to do. This is where I want to go. Okay? This is how I'm doing things. It's like you're not really letting people hold you back. A lot of you guys may have been in a, um, in a, in a, like, a cycle, okay? In a cycle, like, I'm just saying personally, of, like, pleasing, yourself, pleasing other people or trying to make other people feel good here. And it's like, now you're not doing that. It's like, now, it's like, now, over the last couple of weeks, over a couple of months, you've been probably just more like, look, I'm doing this for me. I'm doing A, B, and C, whether you like it or not. You know what I'm trying to say? Um, I definitely feel like a lot of you guys that may have been expecting or that are pregnant, waiting, um, waiting for your bundle of joy, congratulations, a lot of you guys are definitely happy here, or the trials and tribulations, the cycle that you have gone through has made you more stronger, okay, or made you more perceptive, here is also what I'm getting, but also listen to your intuition, your your heart as well, like your heart is now more open, it's now more open is what I'm hearing, you're more patient, okay, skillful as well, a lot of you guys are also more quick witty is also what I'm getting, um, from having children, or maybe you guys are expecting, like I said, so this is what you're going through over the next five days, I definitely feel like a lot of blessings are also going to be coming towards you as well, if you guys are pregnant or expecting, it's like new things are coming towards you here, new ideas, or maybe you're also wanting to do something when it comes to like, um, nature, okay, it could be animals, Cause some children as well that you're moving forward into here. All right. I definitely feel like a lot of new things. Like it's like you guys, whatever your wishes are. Some of you guys may have wrote down some wishes here on eight eight. Okay. And I feel like you're going to be seeing them come true. I definitely feel like there's a need, a strong need for you guys to watch out. And it's not really watch out. It's just like be aware. If you don't feel right when it comes to certain people, okay, realize why things are not working in your life here. Realize why things are working in your life. Realize why you're being very passionate or your energy is more upbeat here. It's like a lot of you guys may also... Um, Taking taking control back, taking your power back as well. Reclaim your power as well. But I'm also getting um a lot of people that may have did some type of black magic spell work, candle work, okay, during the last moon, or like I said, moon magic, water magic, candles, or whatever the case may be. It's like it's backfiring here. You can be seeing these people sleep a lot and get sick, is what I'm getting. Or this is like they're very irritated, they can be drinking or smoking a lot as well. Or they're mentally like not right, mentally unstable, or not thinking in their best mindset. I mean, guys, you can also be seeing these people try and dictate or, like, tell you what to do here. And this is going to make them upset by you saying no or by you saying, no, I'm going to do this as well. I'm also getting when it comes to a job situation, there's a major need um, for you to, like, just continue to be patient, continue to not talk to people, okay? It's just, like, you handle them what you need to, okay? It's, like, being patient, being patient. You're clearing out a lot of your energy here. A lot of people may have also been involved in trying to get you out. Whether this is like a spiritual um, gang stalking, tag teaming is what I'm getting. Okay, where well, a lot of people involved as some type of like workplace here. The Queen of Wands in reverse. I feel like you also know that you can't trust certain people here. This can also be someone that's like in a higher, um, in a higher realm than you here. But this is also communication. Like someone trying to, like I said, get you into type of drama here. With the Page of Wands in reverse and the Three of Wands is like you getting everything that you need to. It's like... Things may have happened for somebody else, um, to somebody else. Maybe you're seeing somebody else get sick or someone else not really getting, like, not really moving up, moving up, okay, or not really having that momentum that you do here. And I feel like someone can also be upset because they don't do things like you or they're trying to figure out what's your formula like. How do you get this done? How do you get, um, how are you able to do this? How, like, for instance, how are you able to do hair? How are you able to do nails? How are you able to read? energy how are you able to cook this good like how are you able to do a b and c you know what i'm saying and not be tired or not be a b and c and that's their question that's the question look knight of wands it's like someone could also be um like bringing somebody to you look 
four of cups. It's like someone's trying to bring someone to you to make you feel like you're less than or like you're not good enough. But it's like also be aware of that energy and spirit and entity that's trying to come to you. Okay, that people can be trying to send to you over the next five days. But I feel like overall, God, your ancestors, your spirit guides, they got you. Like, even like I said, someone claim that they're spiritual or claim that they're doing things. Okay, someone can also also be listening to readings. Or like I said, may have paid a practitioner to do work on you. Maybe they're themselves, they're doing work on you. Or maybe they're trying to make you feel like you're not the shit or you're not as good as you say that you are. Okay, and it's like, you know, like, you already know that you're good. You already know that you're good enough. It's like, don't let these people, like, um, look the high priestess, and I'm just saying what it is. So this is definitely, like, a reading for me to look back into because I feel like this is also has to do a lot of spiritual readers on YouTube, on social platforms as well, okay, that can be older, older than me or people that are doing the same thing. But I'm also getting the high priestess is also, like, me saying and confirming, like, yeah, these are people that you may have dropped past friends, past lovers, past family members. It's going to also be people in your energy at this time that are trying to come back around, or like I said, that may have been trying to dirt on you, like, do work against you, against your relationship, against your job, against your health, against where you're trying to be, against your line, is your bloodline, trying to stop your destiny, it's like, you can't stop nobody's destiny, you can't do that, you can't do magic, you can't do magic or light candles or incense or whatever or speak bad against somebody and thinking that you're going to get a temporary win when in actuality, that's not, that's not how it works, you know what I'm trying to say, so this can also be someone that, um, because I pulled that card that made me feel like, again, this is like spiritual uh, workers that are like 27, 29, 30, 40, 50, okay, that's working against me or doing some type of work here as well. That can also be on YouTube or any social platform, Twitter, Facebook, whatever the case may be. And they're trying to stop my destiny or this can be regular people, right? Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Libra, Leo, uh, Aquarius, okay, Gemini, okay. That are trying to stop blessings. And it doesn't have to be in the spiritual realm. But it's going to also just be in regular life when it comes to you guys as well, right? But the high priestess makes me feel like I'm on the right path. I'm saying everything I need to say. And people are not going to shut me up. Okay, point of the period. I feel like a lot of this is also um, whatever is being done in the dark. It is going to be shown in the light. Because with the sun card, it makes me feel like there is something going to definitely be exposed about these people. Okay? You can also be witnessing like... Um, it's like people may have also people may also be going through like I said changes when it comes to like their family like people may be dying in their family or people can be getting sick okay people kids can be getting sick people can be losing their jobs losing their homes losing their cars here and I feel like this is also um like the side effect the back the background the boomerang for what they have done to you is what I'm getting okay it's like they wanted to wish bad on you here. They was trying to make you feel like you weren't good enough, that you weren't a top down, a six of wands, that you didn't know what you were talking about, but in the end, you really did. And these people are going to be in remorse or guilty that they let you go as a friend or family member that they talk to you in a certain way. This can also be, like I said, a family member that may have been, it's like family members may have known your special know your secrets, know what you're able to do or capable of, and people may have tried to stop you as well, try to stop you from getting to that next level by doing A, B, and C, okay, but I feel like they're going to be in remorse or regret here as well, it's like they're realizing that they see you walking away and their wishes are not being fulfilled, it's like the things that they wished upon for you to, for half, for things to happen to you is not going to go, the stars in reverse, Aquarius, so you can be seeing Aquarius, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, like I said, ages 27, 29, 30, 33, 40, 44, 50, within, within that range, right, doing work with you, or maybe this is, I'm just speaking out, maybe you're watching me, and you are this sign, you are this age, is what I'm getting, because I kept getting the watching cards as well. Yeah, three of pentacles are worse, some of you guys can be definitely watching me, you have did this spiritual work on other people, okay, thinking that it wasn't going to happen. Three of Pentacles is also in reverse, so this can be like, like I said, this is a confirmation that people have been doing work on you because you release any type of bondage, okay? It's like, thank you, Spirit, any type of bondage, okay? Relationship bondage. Three of Pentacles in reverse. Relationships, uh, family, like mother, mother, daughter, auntie, sister, 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 third-party situations, anything that was like, 
getting signed right or getting fit, okay? The unknown card, yes, yeah, like things is happening the way that it needs to. Now you're going to be seeing these people exhausted or they can't do things the way that they used to. Some of these people, like with their ligaments, I got ligaments, nervous system, okay, heart failure, okay, like I said, something to do with their kids. Okay, like I said, some of them are also going to be having to juggle, to a pentacle, juggle a lot of different things here. Or like I said, having to do a lot more than what they bargained for. Some of them has also signed a deal with the devil, queen of swords, okay, that they were supposed to cut off, but they kept going here because so they wanted to... They wanted to be in the limelight. They wanted to be in the limelight when it comes to their friends. Or they wanted to um, make you look bad in some type of way. Make you feel like you needed them. That you And something like that. Okay? Or just like people that tried to treat you bad because they was clicked up. They was in a group. Okay? Or it's like they thought like because they were in a group, they can get you down. They can they can um, shoot you down. They can make you feel like you're less than. But in actuality, it didn't. It gave you more power. It gave you more power. It gave you more power in God and power in prayer and power in God and power in your ancestors. Okay, and gave you more power for you to reach out to God, to your ancestors, the spirit God, and fight back. It's like your ancestors wasn't playing around. They, your ancestors was looking like, okay, since they want to work against you, we got you. You're by yourself. You're by yourself, and this is how we're going to fight back for them. And this is a message for the people that was doing work on me, the people that this is probably a message for you guys that are trying to confirm whether these people are also going to get their karma. Don't wait Don't wait to see that they're going to be doing getting their karma. You're going to hear about it. Okay, if you don't hear about it, you're going to see it. Okay, if you, if it's not that, you're going to be seeing these big, it's like big businesses or big, or people that was like, higher than you that they thought they thought that they were better than you because like i said they were cooked up they had more money or they had whatever it's like you're gonna see these people go down like i said scorpio cancer pisces leo leave the gemini aquarius okay gemini 27 29 30 33 40 45 years yeah, it's gonna be a lot of endings in these people's lives okay it's like they're gonna be indecisive on how they want to come towards you the eight of cups a lot of you guys are walking away. A lot of you guys are not really, it's like turning the other cheek. A lot of these people are going to be trying to buy into your business, like I said. And this is why the beware and the luck was there, okay? It's like these people are going to be trying to buy into your business or buy your products is what I'm getting. And it's like it's not going to be beneficial. It's not even going to put them in the right space. It's not. It's like they thought that they could click up and that could gang up on you, gang stalk you, okay? Older women, people your age, old friends, old lovers, whatever. And it's like that didn't even work. Whatever practitioners that y'all paid, they were weak as fuck. You know what I'm trying to say? If they're really, if they're spiritual healers and all of that stuff, then they would know that you wouldn't do that to try and stop somebody's destiny or karma because you see that they have left in abundance because you see that they're going to be destined for greatness and they're going to be known, okay? Because I feel like a lot of you guys are also, you're still going to be known, you guys, and I felt that, okay? I'm still going to be known. I'm still destined for greatness. I'm still going to be getting this abundance, this money, okay? Moving on into my own house, moving on into my own shit, okay? It's like my energy is also felt, and I feel like a lot of these people, they also been having a lot of dreams, dreams about you about where you're going here about your next steps is also what i'm getting it's like they know that you're destined for greatness your family members know that your relationships know that your people around you know that it's like they're just trying to dim your light dim your shine but why because they don't have it that don't make no sense yeah because they don't have it they're not capable of speaking up so now they want to put all these illusions and they want to do smoky mirrors and confusion and all these games and look and you like look no i'm not even about to deal with that it's okay i'm about to sleep i'm about to rest and rejuvenate these next five days i'm about to get to this bag the chariot is in reverse look and everything that they do is not working everything that they do is like backfiring period dot the ton of pentacles look you're gonna be happy divine feminine over the next five days you're gonna see a lot of money coming towards you a lot of spiritual payback it's like your ancestors god is always watching people be thinking that they could do things in the dark or they could do things or maybe this person always sits in the dark is what i'm hearing maybe this person is also dark um it's gonna be dark skin okay fair skin to dark skin so almond color to really really chocolate some of these people may have also brought your products in the past here and now they're realizing that your products are working, your services are working here, and they're wanting to get on a bandwagon, okay? Before you pop and before before you become famous. A lot of these people are also um 
like I said, having dreams or having nudges about where you're going. Like, they know where you're going before you go there. So they try to stop or delay it. And it's like, that's not how it works. It's like, everything that they've been doing is like, over the next five days, it's like a power up. I'm just getting an upgrade. It's like, everything that they, it's like a clean slate. You have a clean slate. Your ancestors, your angels, God is also on your side. You have a light about you. All this love is coming towards you. Spiritual payback. You gain all this money. It's like, you're sitting comfortably as well. Um, if this is anything when it comes to a work environment, like I said, you have nothing to worry about. You're being patient. You're going to receive some type of accolades as well, recognition, but also be aware of the people that are also congratulating you and they don't feel like you deserve A, B, and C, or maybe they're jealous of the fact that you do have what it takes and they didn't think so. They didn't think that you were going to do A, B, and C. Okay, like I said, a lot of things are going to be spiritual black and it's going to be going in your favor. Okay, you have a lot to look forward to. You have a lot to look forward to, okay? It's 4, 11, 4, 5, 6. 6 is abundance, right? But it's also you, mother, the mother, right? But it's also you realizing that things are happening where that leads to building. Changes, changes after changes is like investing, saving, okay? Getting your abundance, 6, okay? 4, 1, 2, that's 7. It's 4, 12 on the clock, that's 7. Right, so that's divine intervention, divine time, that's a spiritual number, that's also a money number, a lucky number. So a lot of you guys are definitely going to be seeing things change within the next seven hours, is what I'm getting. Your energy is definitely going to be changing, a new way of self, a new way of being as well. Like I said, by the 13th, you're going to be hearing some type of response on your next steps, like I said, on some type of job. A lot of you guys are going to be getting hired or for one job, here's what I'm getting. That's going to really put you in a good space, a good place. I'm also getting a lot of you guys are also going to be, if you guys are also house searching or looking for apartments, looking for different places to live, and you're going to be finding a very good home, a very good deal, a very good um, home for you to live and for you to reside in as well, okay? I definitely feel like a lot of luck is also coming to your business, but you're going to be seeing a lot of things happen, okay? Happen fast, happen quickly, and you're going to just be thinking, I'm getting a lot of happy tears as well. Okay, you on your knees or you're in prayer or you're like I said, it's like a lot of happy tears, happy tears. Like thank you, thank you, God. Thank you, God, thank you, God, thank you, God, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, and much gratitude, okay? So these are the messages that I have for divine feminine the next five days. Peace of the light, I love you guys, I love myself.